Many ancient civilizations took their places in early history and made their significant position around their oppositions. Some built their civilization really very well maintained that there was no chance of backing up. Others only got few chances for that. Due to uncertain circumstances, their civilization fell and nothing left behind. Sumerian civilization was a well-known civilization, but it came to an end and the reasons are given below. Sumer was the southernmost district of old Mesopotamia, advanced Iraq and Kuwait, which is for the most part thought about the support of development. The name comes from Akkadian, the language of the north of Mesopotamia, and signifies place where there are edified lords. Sumerians called themselves the dark-headed individuals, and their property in cuneiform content was basically the land or the place where there are the dark-headed people. And in the scriptural book of Genesis, Sumer is known as Shina, as indicated by the Sumerian king list, when the divine beings previously gave people the endowments vital for developing society. They did as such by setting up the city of Eridu in the area of Sumer. While the Sumerian city of Uruk is held to be the most seasoned city on the planet, the old Mesopotamians accepted that it was Eridu and that it was here that request was set up and progress started. The district of Sumer was for quite some time thought to have been first possessed around 4500 BCE. This date has been challenged as of late in any case, and it currently imagined that human movement in the zone started significantly sooner. The main pilgrims were not Sumerians, but rather a people of obscure cause whom archaeologists have named the Ubaid public. From the exhumed hill of Al-Ubaid, where the curious were revealed, which previously authenticated their reality, or the Proto-Euphratians which assigns them as prior occupants of the area of the Euphrates River. At whatever point the Sumerian development was first settled in the locale, by 3600 BCE they had concocted the wheel comprising the sailboat, horticultural cycles, for example, water system and the idea of the city. It is by and large acknowledged that the principal urban communities on the planet rose in Sumer and, among the most significant, were Eridu, Uruk, Ur, Lhasa, Isin, Adab, Kula, Lagash, Nippur and Kish. Exchange was immovably settled with unfamiliar terrains right now and composing an advance from pictograms to cuneiform content. It is imagined that exchange was the principle that helped the advancement of composing as there now must be few methods for exact, significant distance correspondence between the dealers of Sumer and their representatives abroad. The sovereignty additionally emerged right now and the city conditions of Sumer came to be controlled by a solitary ruler who was helped by a board of seniors, which included the two people. The lords following Etana were Semites, not Sumerians, as confirmed by their names, for example, in Bebaragesi of Kish. It isn't until after the standard of eight rulers past the Sumerian names start to show up in the king list. The political structure of Sumer was free city-states. The guide shows the significant networks. Note that in Sumerian occasions, the Perusian Gulf stretched out to the zone of the city-states. From that point forward, the streams have filled in hundred miles of Gulf and Ur, which was once practically on the coast, is several miles from the ocean. Alongside the guide of Sumer, there is a schematic portrayal of the design of the city of Ur. 
with a part of the Euphrates River going through the city with a secured harbor at the city dividers. There was one more insured harbor at the city dividers. The sanctuary grounds were isolated from the remainder of the city. The tale of Samur resembles the plot to a science fiction story. The cutting edge world learns of its reality through references in old writings to even more antiquated occasions. The Sumerians showed up at the beginning of history as a completely evolved society with an innovation and association that was unique and better than different social orders of the time. What's more, human advancement itself appears to have originated from these outsider and strange individuals. Socialists proposed what they guaranteed was another and reformist structure of society, yet what they were by all accounts attempting to make was essentially the very kind of society that the Sumerians made with a ministry controlling the general public and its economy 5,000 years prior. The Sumerian progress got referred to the advanced world because of references to summer in comparisons found through the examinations of the remains of Babylon and related urban areas. The Sumerians vanished from history around 2000 BC because of military mastery by different Semitic people groups. Specifically, in around 2000 BC, Sargon set up a dominion in Mesopotamia which incorporated the zone of Sumer. During the Akkadian and Ur three stages, there was a move from the development of wheat to the more salt open minded grain. However, this was deficient, and during the period from 2100 BC to 1700 BC, it is assessed that the populace here declined by almost three-fifths. This incredibly deliberated the overall influence inside the district. Some researchers said that the fall of Sumerian civilization was because of their own mistakes that took the great parts of the civilization from them.